Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to replace a keyboard for the HP EliteBook Folio 1040 G3. The tools needed is a Phillips head, a star screwdriver, and this tool here. What you need to do is turn the Ultrabook on the other side, on the back. So as you can see the back case in here, there's 11 screws in total. And one in the middle. So once you unscrew the screws, you put your finger here and you lift up. The back case will come off. So now you can see the battery. This battery needs to be removed as well. So you unclip this power cord from this slot here. So from here you need to pull out. And then um, you've got to unscrew the screws here. As you can see there's an arrow imprinted. So one here, you've got another one here, you've got another one here, one here one here so yeah basically uh, where the arrows are we we'll lift this uh, battery put it in a safe place you need to remove two screws for demonstration purposes I've removed everything so it's more easier um, to fast track this video so yeah um, you've got one screw here if I zoom in KB keyboard so you've got to remove one screw from here and the other one here KB so two screws in total once you remove the screws you put them in a safe place and then you've got to unclip the ribbon keyboard ribbon there's two keyboard ribbons that need to be removed from its motherboard slot holder one here as you can see you lift it up from here, you take it out. That's the first ribbon, the second ribbon being this next to it. So, this ribbon here, you unplug and you pull it out. So, once you've done that, you turn the ultra book around on its front, you open up the lid. And then you use this tool here. So you slowly and gradually you, ask, you start to unpick from here and then you work your way across here and then down here and then you just pull it out. You can see the ribbon here and this ribbon here and in there. So uh, yeah, that's how you remove the keyboard for HP Elite Book Folio 1040G3. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe, comment, and like. There's more contents to come. Uh, thank you for watching.